Hello everybody. So this is the van we're working on this week. Gorgeous. Ducato motorhome. We have done a full Victron setup on this, including two Victron solar panels, both 305 watts each. They're big. So 610 watts. Now we've nearly finished the install. We're just waiting to do the mains 240 side of this inverter, but let's show you the battery first. What a battery this is. This is a battery from EcoTree, it's an under seat battery and it's perfectly shaped. And it's in this really rugged, tough box with decent handles. Let me show you this battery, it is quality. So this is underneath the passenger seat. You can see the shape of this battery. You can see like it's got quality handles under here as well. We've used them handles and zipped, these some big zip ties as well just to help hold it in place some more. We built a big a wooden tray for it to sit on so it's not going to slide anywhere. And those handles would, those zip ties will also hold it down as well. But yeah, look at the shape of this battery. It's a 230 amp hour, I believe. And we used a, a bar between the positive and the, and the mega fuse. But yeah, love this battery. The case is really it's a proper metal case. It's really, I love that battery. So yeah, this is the van. You have to excuse. There's a sit diet seating area here, and then there's a kitchen in the middle. Fridge here, kitchen here. If you go through, there's a centre sink. This is like the bathroom area, toilet, and a shower here. Dividing wall, and then you can go either way around to the bed area. See, I love this van. This this is this van would convince me to leave self-built panel vans. I think if I could afford it, but they're obviously a lot of money. So yeah, the Victron stuff. We managed to cram it all into this little cupboard down here. It is not finished yet. We have not done all the cable management properly and tidying everything up. However, what we got going on here? We have. The Victron distributor. This is bus bars and fuses in here. A, uh, a main isolator cut off switch. There's a smart shunt down there, which you probably can't see that well, but there's a smart shunt down there. The battery monitor, we've got the servo. Um, I'll show you the screen for the servo in a mo. We've got a 150 amp MPPT mounted on this these angled brackets that we've that we've done. And we've got the Orion mounted onto this wall here. There was actually a vent on the side of this unit here. Um, there was ducting coming through the floor underneath here and going into there. That was for the diesel, uh, for the heater. So that we actually got rid of that and we moved it to the other side of the step here, which was quite clever, we thought. And also it gives, the, there's a hole underneath here for ventilation, so this can get some fresh air from outside. And we're gonna be putting fans in, there's a, a vent here and there's a vent there going there. So we're gonna put fans and stuff as well, I think. Try and keep it cool. Um, but yeah, so the screen for the servo is actually up here. We haven't programmed this yet. So that is the Touch 70. So that's where you can monitor and control the whole system, see what's going on. So yes, this is what Bluefix have been doing this week. Yeah, really happy with how this is coming along. I'm sure the customer will be happy, I hope so. Customer will be here in a day or two to collect. But yes, yeah, that's what we've been up to. If you want some electrical work done in your van, if you want all the Victron stuff supplied, we do offer very competitive discounts. So yeah, let us know. If you want parts, just advice, or you want us to install it as well, we can come to you or you, you can come to us. Drop us a message, email addresses down below. Oh, it looks lovely. You gotta appreciate the blue stuff. Thanks for watching, guys. See you soon.